Hey, my name is May, like the month, and today I'm gonna show you what I thrifted. It was my birthday over the weekend. I am freshly 24, baby. Soak it all in. I wish I knew a song about being 24. What I did for my birthday is that I went on this cute little getaway. Getaway being 45 minutes out of the city, but it was just nice to, you know, have some peace and quiet and go thrifting. Suburban thrifting is probably one of my favorite things ever. Because I live in a major city, everything is quite picked over and it's really busy. So being out in the sticks, out in the boonies, it is very, very lovely because you get to see like different fashion. I know how I'm like 45 minutes away, but fashion changes quite drastically depending on where you are. So it was great. I had such a good time and I also wanted to thank you for all of your birthday wishes. M makes my heart feel so like warm and fuzzy on the inside and I just can't thank you enough. Without further ado, let's just get right into it. First thing I thrifted were these boys school pants. They are quite thin material which I really like so it hangs off the leg. Quite lovely. And for my sizing, because I am quite short, I'm a staggering five foot three and three quarters, rounded up, five foot four. And my waist sizing is around a 23, 24, depending on what company I'm going for. It is quite hard to find pants at a thrift store that would fit me. So I like to go to the boys section and I managed to score these guys. They are really nice because they're high waisted and I can pair them with basically anything. So yeah. Fun, pants, we love to see it. Second thing that I thrifted that I am in love with, I've been seeing a lot of cardigans come back up on Instagram and I just, oh, they look lovely and I wanna be a part of that. So I decided to pick up this cardigan. There's not much I can really say about it. I like to wear this either all buttoned up and just make it as a top so my decolletage is out or I like to pair it with like a sports bra or like a tiny, tiny top and have it as a shawl. For me personally, I feel most safe wearing really baggy things over my arms. I'm not sure why that is. I had a conversation with a friend talking like about security items. And for me, that is just a very baggy item on my arms and just making me feel warm and cozy. So I'm definitely gonna be wearing this a lot come like summer and winter time or now if i'm feeling zesty enough next thing i thrifted was this plaid shirt again going back to like security feeling and layers and covering up my arms this one is originally from american eagle but you know what plaid is plaid baby and it's cozy and it's really soft and i like to wear it either just fully buttoned up as a top or just throw it over again a tiny top if you guys are following me on my Instagram, all of you know that I'm the biggest fan of like tiny tops and baggy pants. And this will just be perfect transitioning into the cooler temperatures. This guy is a oversized button down. I think in my try on lookbook thing, I'm wearing it as a dress. I love how like smock-esque it feels and it looks, which makes me happy and I've been obsessed with like these off-white kind of cream wheat oat shades lately. So I can wear it as a dress or I can just put it on as a layering piece. Makes me happy, makes a girl happy. It's very, very big. I think it like just cuts off above my knees, but yeah, I like it. I got this t-shirt kind of bodysuit Thing in this off-white color. Originally it's from Ann Taylor. Very very stretchy which I like and it is quite tight enough where I don't have to wear a bra. Personally, for me, pierced nipples with a tight top. Super powerful. Love to see it. So that's why I picked up this guy and I don't have any t-shirt-esque bodysuits in my collection so I thought that this would be a great staple to have in my wardrobe if I ever wanted to wear something like super high-waisted like jeans and just have this. Ah, yeah, why not? Next thing I thrifted was this Reebok workout top. Love a good workout top, especially if I do yoga and all this stuff. It's just nice to have and switch up and feel new and fresh. But 
The reason why I picked up this top is because I really like the seams on it. Looks something like that. Another reason why I love to pick out workout tops is because I can also wear them as a bra. I've stated in a couple of videos ago that for me personally, my chest area, I love a more compressed look. I don't really love things with underwire or padding, so having something like this that just keeps everything in, copacetic. Absolutely copacetic. And the last thing that I thrifted was these pair of pants. I think they're originally from Aritzia. That's what Babaton means, right? Or Wilfred? I don't know. I thrifted it for like, I think $7. They're these fun like cropped balloon pants. For me personally, to make my body look longer, I love anything that is cropped and I love a baggy pant. Just that silhouette really works well with my body, so I picked this guy up. With everything that's going on right now, we can't try any clothes on, which is super understandable. A tried and true trick for thrifting or if you don't want to try on pants, because personally, trying on pants is one of the top 10 least sexy things, in my opinion. I remember this one specific day where I was out jean shopping because I really wanted to get a new pair of jeans, and the amount of jeans that I tried were, it was just absorbent. It was criminal and I was so over by the end of the day. It's exhausting. Trying on pants, I think, should be a sport. It feels like a blood sport. It's, yeah, yeah. Anyways, I'm tangenting. A trick that I have that everybody has is that you just take the waistband of the pants and you put it around your neck and if it touches, then it should fit your waist. That's what the world kind of says and it does work for me. These ones, I will admit, I just fell in love with them. So I was like, oh, it kind of like, oh yeah, sure. I was gonna get them anyways. They are quite tight, but it's okay. I will make it work. I really, really like these. And you can tell that Latte likes them as well because there is cat fur all over it. I don't know why I keep on buying black pants, especially with a very, very fluffy cat. But yeah, I'm gonna count this piece as well in terms of my thrifting haul. It's this olive champion sweater that I got a week ago. It's really cozy. I find for me, men's medium is perfect for like a little baggy look, but the sleeves aren't like flooding up my entire arms. So I'll count this guy as well. Thank you so much for watching this video. I appreciate all of you. If you guys want me to do anything else for next week's video, please let me know. Do I have any ideas for what I want to do next week? No, I really don't. For me, videos are very like impromptu, spur of the moment. I will film and do whatever makes me happy. I don't have a set schedule. One thing about me is that I'm a Virgo, as you all know, and it is very hard <laughs> to force myself to do something that I don't want to do. If I don't feel like filming that day, I won't film. If I feel like this idea is forced, then I won't do it. That's just who I am. That's why I love doing like these thrifting videos or simple makeup or just talking, whatever I feel in the moment. If you have any ideas, please let me know. I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you very soon.